Good morning everyone. Welcome to a day of my life as a master thesis student in Germany. If you are watching my video for the first time, my name is Rushikesh and I'm currently doing my master thesis in an electronics manufacturing company in Germany and I'm studying masters in embedded systems at Hochschule Rangsburg Weinberg. And this is how my day starts. I wake up at 5 o'clock in the morning. I have to get up this early so that I have to, I can finish my daily tasks. And it is June now. It's already bright outside. The nights are quite small during these days here in Germany and uh, it's been only one th- one month remaining now to finish my master thesis. So this video is going to be an accurate representation of how I spend my day, my daily tasks uh, as part of as a, as a master thesis student. And I'm, I'm going to show the things I do here and I'm sure this is the case for every other master's th- master thesis student uh, during this time. So stay tuned. First task I like to do in the morning is to solve some coding questions for practice. I have some job interviews and coding test scheduled and I'm preparing for it. Moreover, my experience has shown that I can write better logic in the mornings. Uh, so I prefer to do it that way. Also, I have to go to office daily to work on my thesis. It's kind of a full-time job. So I prefer to get some tasks done before that. Now it's time to pack up things and get ready for work. Usually it takes one hour to reach my office. Uh-huh. I take public transport. I have to take two buses, and then it will drop me right in front of the office. Earlier, okay, here it is. Shiny day it is. So earlier I used to take my bicycle to the bus stop, and then from there onwards I will take the bus, which will directly drop me right in front of the office. But for some time now, uh, this used to be my bicycle, which I used to take. Uh, but for some time now it has got a flat tire and the problem is it with the wall I mean no matter how many times I in the air uh, it, it has a leakage and that I have to fix it I neither have the tools to repair it by myself and nor I'm willing to take it to the repair shop it it wouldn't be it would be fair to say that I am procrastinating it because it is just some time left that I will be finishing my thesis and then I'll be done with it and uh, I'll be moving somewhere else so uh, somehow I can manage it. I enjoy my time in the office. Some days are hectic with status meetings, presentations, preparation, etc. And some days are chill. I have to give the thesis status to my supervisors. I have to again present challenges in thesis and solutions before my teammates. Mine is an interesting topic for thesis. So I do my research part and then develop my solutions on it. But I I get a hell lot of errors while doing so. And in the end, I have to document all of that. But I also have got amazing colleagues with whom I enjoy working and they make the day easy. I left from my office now and I'm heading towards my university. I had bought, borrowed one hardware from my professor uh, to work on my personal projects and now, now is the time to return it. So uh, there is one in- in interesting thing about my company where I'm doing my master thesis. So the contract is for 40 hours per week. 
and that means I have to work eight hours per day. So the thing is, as as I started my master thesis, they said like there is no need to uh, maintain a timesheet or there is no need to punch as well. So they know that even a master students, even though uh, they work as a eight eight hours per week in office, they also have to work more at home. So they said there is no need to. Uh, maintain a time sheet so you can work as much as you can uh, for as many hours as you want and then you can go home and uh, work on that so, was... so yeah so this was the little info that I wanted to share with you uh, but again it, it depends on company to company on contract so yeah After I come home and relax a little bit, it's the time to send some job applications. If you don't know, let me tell you, you get a lot of rejections here. So therefore you have to keep on applying. I know I already have said I got some job interviews planned, but I can't rely on them. So what I do, I keep on applying. So I use websites like LinkedIn, Stepstone. This thing takes a lot of time, you know. I already, I have carefully, I have to carefully see the job ad then see if my profile is suitable for the position then research on the company prepare documents like cover letter and uh, cv personalize it and then send so after i finish my masters i'm going to make a video on my job application and interview experience that will be more detailed
this is how my life is uh, during my master thesis here in germany i hope i have managed it to properly show you a glimpse of it and uh, again i hope you enjoyed this video do let me know in the comments whether you liked it or not and also do subscribe to the channel because that is important i uh, it really gives me motivation to create more content for you guys and if you have any more suggestions about the content that i should make on uh, do let me know in the comments so that is all for today and i'll see you once again bye bye